Hey guys, how's it going? Me and my son uh, has come up today to check our snares. We've only had them out one day so far and we took them off again because we had like five, six days in a row with a lot of rain. Usually not much running when the weather is like that, so uh, we figured we might as well take them up. The snares that we did have out, uh, we came up yesterday and um, reset them because we got about three days now in a row that's going to be fairly good. And we're going to be just the first, last night was the first night on them, so uh, we're going to check them here today now. Just checked our first snare. Nothing in that one. I wasn't expecting to get one in this particular snare actually because there's still a lot of water in that on. And according to what I was told, the any areas is flooded up. You know, rabbits not usually uh, running there yet. But I put a, I put a snare there anyway because you never know what's right. You don't know unless you try. It's a job to get a rabbit if uh, you don't have a snare there at all, eh? So, last year I didn't have any snares out at all. But the year before that, we got a few rabbits here. Actually, I had, I'm not sure it was four or five rabbits. I can't remember now. I ended up getting a fox on my run. There was one morning, there was two rabbits eat. There was another morning, I had one rabbit eat. A single one eat, and I three mornings in a row. So after that, I took my... Uh, snares up because according to what I was told uh, you know if you get a fox on your run like that eating your rabbits you know he's just going to keep coming back so I took him up So I got one snare here guys, did get a rabbit there uh, here for last, it's a fairly good lead there so uh, I wasn't going to pass this one up that's for sure. So if you notice there I use the uh, uh, six strand pitcher cord, pretty much all I've used for years. Uh, of course here in Newfoundland all we can use is uh, the brass wire and the six strand pitcher cord. Now personally I really don't like the brass wire for a number of different reasons but for me personally I just find that the uh, six strand uh, pitcher cord is, is, is easy to work with so uh, and I've never had any issues with it and I know that uh, you know s several members of my family also use the six strand uh, pitcher cord as well so I guess you just keep using whatever works for you I guess I I did try to to brass wire I don't know, uh, I just, uh, I did have a couple break half on it and I know some people say well it depends on the brand so that could be as well but I just find that it's uh, it's harder to work with, right? Yeah. Another one right here guys so as you can see I got a few boughs stuck in the ground there and like that, that's going to help guide them in the snare there and of course it's uh, going to also help prevent them from jumping over the crossbar, right? And if you look just below my snare there I just, I got a little twig stuck in the ground and under and did it just helps uh, guide the rabbit's head up into the snare so he's not like trying to go and hunt it so that'll help you know leading into the snare right so all snares check guys and no luck and to be honest I wasn't uh, I wasn't really expecting anything especially after all this rain there's actually two things working against us you know, everything is still swamped and uh, a lot of the rabbits are white now as well and there's no snow you know that usually means you know they're not uh, they're not going to be running as much right you still might get an odd one but for the most part they're not going to be running so we're just going to check on a place here now and we're going to ball off on that but uh, uh, we got plans of putting a little a little bridge across the brook here in the winter time some areas of the brook where I want to cross is usually a little bit difficult right like obviously some places it's froze up but where I want to cross the brook is usually never ever froze up 
So the plan is to, uh, to put a bridge across. So that's going to be another trip now because I'm going to bring my chainsaw for that and uh, make quick work of it. You know, it's only going to be for, you know, walking across. So, you, don't, you know, we don't need nothing massive or we don't need to put a lot of work into it or nothing like that, right? So... Well, guys, we just uh, air boil some water that there now and get a little something to eat before we heads out. Unfortunately, we didn't have any luck with the rabbits, but you know that's how we go sometimes. We don't have a lot of snares out anyway. There's uh, what six, I think five, so, yeah, five, like five or six. Five or six. Yeah. You know, it's obviously a numbers game anyway. So, but you know, as the as the winter goes, I'll eventually get more and more out each time, right? I uh, do have some channel updates planned. I'm, I'm not going to talk about it right now, but I'm going to talk about it when I, uh, when I do the uh, winter announcement uh, video. I'm going to talk about a little bit about what I'm going to be doing for future videos. It's going to be pretty good, so be sure to uh, watch for that video. Like I said, that's when I announce the uh, winner of the uh, $50, $50 Amazon gift card. So when I, when I announce that, I'm going to be announcing some channel updates and uh, I will say that it's, it's just a way that I'm going to be giving back to uh, people that uh, support me, right? So uh, be sure to keep watch for that. Uh, so the way we got to size up now, I think we got about three days now in a row that, uh, you know, it's going to be some pretty good weather. There's, we, we haven't got a break the past few weeks, just rain, rain, rain. But, you know, I guess we can't complain compared to, uh, you know, some areas out west and that don't have it very good, so you know, it just uh, puts a damper, I guess, on like rabbit snaring and things like that. So, guys, we're just going to start picking up and get ready and head out. Uh, pretty good day, I, I enjoyed it anyway. When you comes up, you know, just for a feed, sit by the fire for half hour, hour, or whatever, you know, just. Uh, that's a lot better than sat home staring at a TV or something, I find, anyway. I hope you like that little pot hanger I made. Pretty simple. Very easy to adjust if you got to, right? There's no, there's no end to how many different ones you can make, right? But anyway, guys, that's it for this video. And I appreciate you taking the time to watch. And I'll see you in the next one.